Hello, good evening. Can you hear me? Good night, teacher. Good evening, Christian. How are you? I'm fine. And you? Good. I'm doing okay. Thank you. How how was your vacation? Uh, very good. Uh, Did you rest? Rest. Rest. Yeah. So you say oh, okay. I I rested every day. I, I rest rested every day. Every day. Okay. Good. Thank you. Good. Nice. Nice. Helen, how are you? Helen, Helen. I guess she doesn't hear me. Okay, anyways. So, did you do anything uh, in particular, Christian? Did you what? visit did you visit any places? Your no. family, friends? No. No. So, you stayed in your house? Yes. Good. Good. Where, where do you live again? I live in San Marcos. San Marcos. Okay. I visited San Marcos when I was a kid because my cousins, they were from San Marcos, Colonial Milagro. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Sí. So I visited their house uh, a lot of times, mm -hmm. a lot of times. So, but those are memories. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> memories. Are you from San Marcos? Are you from San Marcos, Christian? Um, me pregunta en qué parte en específico, ¿verdad? No, que si es de ahí. Yo. Ajá. Are sí, you from sí. San Marcos? Yes. Sí, okay. yes. Good. All right. Stephanie, Sofía Stephanie and Stephanie Montano. The two Stephanies. <laughs> How are you? Fine. Good, good. How was your vacation, Sofia? Very good. Uh huh. Yes, with my family going. Uh, we went. We went to Auto Cinema. Okay. Yes. And where is Auto Cinema? I haven't. Uh, the Secretaría de la Cultura. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Yes. Okay. All right. Doing the the event. Uh huh. Yes. In one week. Okay. Yes. Oh, that's good. And you, Stephanie Montano, how are you today? You rested. Okay. Jimena Alexandra, how are you? Hi, teacher, fine. Good. Did you rest on vacation, Jimena? Yes. <laughs> Good. Helen, can you hear me? Helen Mercedes? I guess not. Okay, welcome back. What is today's date? What is the date for today? Is it November, July, March? What is it? August 10th. August 10th. Yes, August 10th. What year? What's the year, class? 2020. Good. 2020, exactly, very good. All right, so welcome back everybody. Do you guys remember our last class? Do you remember our last class? No. Did you read your book on vacation? No, huh? He said, what book? <laughs> <laughs> the 
vacation. All right. I think it yeah. was a review. Yeah, it was a review. Exactly. We had a review. Okay. Do you remember the topics that we covered in that class? Comparatives. Comparatives. Exactly. Remember that we have short adjectives and we have long adjectives and we compare them differently. So if it's a short adjective, you put ER at the end. If it's a long adjective, you use more. Okay, what else did we mention? What else did we talk about? Do you remember the topics that we covered? No? Fanboys. What is it? Fanboys. Fanboys, yes, fanboys. Mm. Yeah, conjunctions for, or, nor, da, da 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 da, and all that. Do you have any questions about our last class? Any questions or comments? No? Okay, so um, last week was supposedly vacation. Um, maybe you visited places, maybe you stayed in your house, maybe you visited families or I don't know, or maybe you worked normal. So um, that's going to be our first activity. I will assign you to work in pairs. When you talk about the actions that you did last week, which tense are we using? Which tense are we practicing? Simple past. Simple past, exactly. So I went, I visited, I cleaned, I painted. So you always use the simple past tense. You can make a combination, the simple past with the past continuous, uh, used to, and, and all those things you guys already know. So I will assign you to be working in pairs, practicing your simple past tense, which is very, very important. So the question will be, what did you do last week? What did you do last week? All right, so let me assign you. Da -da -da -da. Five. All right, here we go. Da -da 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 -da. Hello, Coralia. I can't hear you. I can't hear you. I hear you now. Hello. How are you? Hi, and you, how are you? Good, I'm doing okay, thank you. How was your vacation? Oh, it's... It was very good. <laughs> nice, nice. Did you do anything? Um, just um, I I went. I went uh -huh. to I went to my house in Nauisalco. Okay. I I have some some relaxing time. Good. Nahuizalco, Nahuizalco is famous for the chorizos. Yes, it's very famous. Yes. Britos, chorizo yeah. Britos. Yeah, okay. Yes, they are my neighbors. Oh, okay. Do you know the price of the chorizos? Yes, uh, the price is um, docena. 
dozen. Dozen. Uh -huh. uh, um, one dollar per dozen. One dollar. One yes, one dollar per dozen. Oh. Here into into town. Okay. Into town is great. Okay, hey, good. Yeah. Good to know. Yes. <laughs> All right. Are very delicious. I um, imagine. Yes. Um, I think I have to make join. A this. Join. Yes. The group. Okay. Thank yes. you. Yes. All right. Good. <laughs> Papas twister, fried potatoes, like um, twister potato, fried twister potato, something yeah. like that. Yeah, you only say twisters. Twisters. Yeah. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah. I. Uh, I did a lot of things. For example, the last Monday, I bought a, a little swimming pool, and and we put we put it in my garden. Uh, so after so after that uh, Thursday or Wednesday, I I don't remember, but uh, I watched a TV with my with my girlfriend. I ate different food. For example, uh, I ordered a pollo campero and so on. So uh, I had different, different uh, errands. Do you mean, do, do you know uh, what means errands? Uh, because I, I, I have a lot of uh, how do you say ah depth, depth how do you say deudas depths 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 okay but it, it was a a strange week i guess because i i i, I didn't do uh, for example i i didn't visit the beach for example so in my case this is this it in my case, it was my, my vacation. Week. All right. My in a specific moment. For example, my, my vacation, my, my last, no, no sé, como mis últimas vacaciones, pero es un momento específico. My last vacation. My last vacation. Eh, Maybe the scream a little more big. It, it was it was small. It's very interesting. Yeah. Yes. Carolina, I... tell us about yourself. What did you do last week? The last week I go to a tequisaya. I okay. went to a Tikisaya and we we share with the, with some friends, uh, family. Okay. Of my boyfriend, and it's very a nice experience. A nice experience. It's the <laughs> first times I I go out in this. Did you visit the waterfalls, Coralia? No. No. no? No, because that place are closed in this moment. Oh, we right. We cannot visit yet. Right, right. Atikisaya. Atikisaya, yes. But I think that in another moment, I go to the... Good, yes. We will have time for, for all those things. Yes, it's very, it's, it's very nice. Yes. <laughs> Hi, teacher. Hello, how are you? Fine. I think Araceli has 
problem with the internet. Really? Uh -huh, because Christian and I, we don't listen very well when she is okay. speaking. Okay, right, right. Yeah, mm -hmm. and her image is dark, so we, we don't see her. Exactly. I think it's the internet. But... Yeah, it could be. It could mm -hmm. be because everybody has different connections, you know, like 10 megabytes, mm -hmm. 5 megabytes, 15, 20. So everybody has a different connection. So I think okay. maybe it was the storm. Uh, yes, that one too, because it rained hard. Yes. It rained hard. So let me see. I have one person trying to uh, sign right there. Okay. So let me, all right. Okay. What, um, what, is, what, what is your opinion, Maria del Carmen, about this year? Uh, this year is, I don't know, <laughs> she's so different. <laughs> Very different. Yes, it's unique. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's very different. The holidays. What did you do the last week, Marcela? Well, I went to Sonsonate because I'm from Sonsonate to see my family, to visit my family. What part of Sonsonate are you from, Marcela? From Sonsonate, see. Sí. Oh, okay. Good. Mm -hmm. So you have family living there in Sonsonate? Yes, my father and my mother. Good, good. Do you have brothers and sisters? Yes, a brother. But, he's not, but he's not in Sonsonate anymore. No, he lives in Santa Ana. Oh. Because he's studying. Okay, good. You mm -hmm. and... All the time. And then I travel to San Francisco and I walk Golden Gate and I ate. Ay, se me olvidó sopa de. Camarón, hey. No. <laughs> <laughs> Se llama Shoulders, the restaurant. Oh, Is that in Fisherman Wharfs, Stephanie? Yes, yes, teacher. El, el, el plato principal es la, la sopa de almeja, pero no me acuerdo cómo se dice. Okay. Clap. Clams. Sopa de almeja. Clams. Clamson. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and, and, it, and I imagine that it was expensive too. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It, San Francisco yeah. is an expensive city. It's an expensive city, and and it's a cosmopolitan city. Yeah. Tiene todo. Yes. Yeah, different places, different ethnic groups, races, everything. They have variety. Yes, it's, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's, I tell people it's the second most beautiful city in the world. Yes. What is the first one? Yeah, El Salvador is the first one, exactly. Ah, okay, okay. <laughs> Yeah, you know, you have to be proud, orgulloso of your country. Exactly. Yeah. Yes. San Salvador, Santana, Huachapán, San Miguel, all San in Miguel. Salvador is beautiful. Oh, yeah. yeah. But San Francisco is a very nice city. Strongly recommended. Try yeah. San yeah, San Francisco is, is, is one of the best places to visit in the United States, but it's very expensive. Very expensive. Because, because with uh, Airbnb, uh -huh. 
that uh, the possibility, no, the Posible, eh, le da la posibilidad de, de alojarse en un lugar como más cómodo y más acogedor que en un hotel. Yeah, yeah. San Francisco is a beautiful place. Yes. Okay. The place that Burger have is very nice because you you have from from Burger House is the ferro, eh, la eh, vía ferrocarril. La vía ferrocarril. The yeah. restaurant in the Via Ferrocarril. Yes, yes, it's is the teacher. How do yes. you say um, La Via Ferrocarril? Railroad. Rail. Railroad. Rail, 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 Rail means riel, oh. right? And road means camino, so oh. railroad. Yes, it's from the rail, railroad. Rail. Yes. And you can see, you can see the train, Teacher, you uh, can see another How do you picture. say este, antiguo? Old. Old. Or, or you can say antique. Antique. Yes, antique. it's very antique. Yeah. Yes. Are you talking about Sonsonate? Yes. Uh, from a, a restaurant, it's very antique. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what, what's, what's the name of the restaurant? Burger House. Burger oh. house. And how much how much are the burgers? Uh, two and a half dollars. Really? Yes, we potato fries. Okay. And, uh, French fries. Soda, a French fries and soda. Really? That's it's that very price, cheap. Yeah, it's very accessible. Yeah, it's very accessible. Good. Yes, good. that is all antique. Yeah, and but are are antique. the hamburgers good? Yes, yes. Uh, are good, are good, oh yes, are good. <laughs> but I think that we, we buy it, we buy it because we have nostalgia. Uh-huh. Nostalgic. You're, okay, you're, you're homesick. Yeah, it's just homesick. We have a very homesick with, it, with this place because my parents go to this place. <laughs> They are, uh, they are boyfriends. Oh, um, boyfriend, and they, girlfriend. Oh. Yes, boys and girlfriends. And uh, all that is with all Sansonate. I think uh, all the parents of my generation uh, have the first day in that restaurant. Really? How it's many? A, it's uh, a reference. Yes, it's a reference. Oh. <laughs> yes, so, it's a reference. So how many years has this place existed? Um, I think um, 44 years, I think, yeah. or 15. 50. 50, 50, sorry. Okay. 50, yes, yeah, but it's very antique. Okay, Fernando, do you know this place? No, teacher. No. Okay. No. And, and you, Sofia? <laughs> no. Okay. All, all my vacation were at the house. Uh, so, so I went to the visit my grandmother. Only activity, cleaning my room, playing video game with my brother, teacher, in my house. Only in my house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not many options. Not many options. Yeah. For the moment, nothing. Right. So for yeah. the moment, we, we need to be obedient and stay home. <laughs> yep. Yeah. All right. Exer exercise uh, at home. Mm -hmm. I made lunch. No, perdón. I made lunch for my brothers. Mm. Good. What kind of food do you cook? Good question. Yes. What kind of food did you cook, Christian? You say no. you, you, you cook lunch for your brothers. What did you cook? Uh, spaghetti. Uh huh. Um, uh, oh, huevo picado, no sé cómo se dice. <laughs> huevo, what? Uh, huevo picado. picado. Uh -huh. Oh, scrambled egg. <laughs> scrambled egg. Okay. How do you spell? Um, uh, let me write it in the chat. Scramble. 
You see, it's scrambled. Mm, scrambled. It's a new word for me. Good. So when you go to a restaurant, you said, uh, and I think I'm going to have some eggs. So they ask you, how do you want your eggs? Fried, scrambled, boiled. So scrambled. Mm -hmm. Thank you, teacher. Yeah. Christian, what ingredients do you use to make uh, the scrambled egg? Mm, eight. Uh, eight the, the kitchen. Okay, but what ingredients did you use? What ingredients? ¿Qué ingredientes? Mm, some... Quiero ver. Tomato? Eggs. Tomato. Um, oils. No sé uh -huh. Aha, yeah, oil. Um, um, onion. Onion. Cebolla. Green Salt. pepper. <laughs> Salt. Salt. Salt, uh aha. -huh. Um, pepper. Aha, uh -huh. green pepper. Yes. All right. Good. Two years. Three of my cats, no, two are two years. One is one year and two is five months. Hmm. They are uh, parents or sisters? No. Las la dos chiquitas sí. Pero las demás son adoptadas de la calle. Oh. You're talking about your cats, Marcela? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. So they're not they, they, they're not family? No, only two. Okay. Good. So how many cats do you have again, uh, Marcela? Five. Five. I adopt from the street. Okay. Good. <laughs> mm -hmm. The vacation, you work. Only Wednesday and Thursday. Ah, oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Only for two days, I okay. I didn't work. So you were free Friday and Saturday, I imagine. Yes. Okay. So Not you had a day for me. Yeah, but you had a long weekend. Uh, a three-day so, weekend. Yeah, can be. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Three yeah. day off. Right, right. You know, one day is one day. Yeah. <laughs> it's the difference. Yeah, makes a big difference. difference. It makes a big difference. Yes. Okay. All right. So I think it's time to go back to the main session. Okay. Okay. Exactly. With Samuel and Conception. One more minute. Thank you, teacher. All right. So we're almost going back to the main session. Okay. Thank you. Uh -huh. Licenciatura en periodismo. Entonces, como está el canal y está la radio, entonces estoy en el área de relaciones públicas manejando este los spots publicitarios, las cuñas, eh, los afiches, eh, los banners. Las páginas web, las redes sociales. Oh. Where do you work, Fernando? In the Association Arabe. Oh, right, right, right. So, so you're studying to be a journalist? In the journalist, yes. Oh. Good, good. Luis. Hi, teacher. How are you, Luis? Fine, thank you, teacher. How was your vacation? Very, uh, I worked hard all day. <laughs> oh my goodness. Serra Contable, how do you say Serra Contable in English? Feria Contable. No, Serra Contable. Oh, you're closing your accounting. Yes, closing accounting. So a lot of work. Sí. Okay. Yes. All right, good. All right, teacher, so, yes, sir. Uh, how do you say fiestas patronales? <laughs> uh, you, you call them patronal festivities. 
or okay. local festivities. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, local. Mm -hmm. Local festivities. Okay. All right. So let's go back. All right, welcome back everybody. Some of you guys incorporated a little bit later today, so it's good to see you again. Okay, now remember when you say the word vacacion in English, the right pronunciation is vacation. 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 So it's not vacation, vacation it's vacation. 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 Okay, how many syllables do you hear in the vacation. word vacation? Three. Yes, vacation. How do you know? Three is correct. How do you know? Vacation. Okay, so three is correct. How do you know that it has three syllables? How do you know? With the, with the, Number of votes that you hear in the pronunciation. Very good. Vacation. Exactly. Your answer is good. So he says the number of vowels that you hear indicate how many uh, syllables the word has. Very good. All right. Um, any questions or comments about your vacation? Vacation. 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 Mm -hmm. No? Okay, so um, now it's time to open your book on page 17, part one. Do you have your books open? Yes. Okay. Let me see this here. <laughs> Where is this book? I had it somewhere here. Uh, uh, right here. Seventeen. Thirteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Okay, do you see the book? Where it says part one? Yes. Okay. Yes. May I have a volunteer to read the two questions, please? Volunteer, volunteer. Our procedures. Procedures. Are procedures in a restaurant important? Uh huh. Is a customer experience in a rest in a restaurant affected by procedures? Okay, good, very good, thank you. Procedures. Procedures. Procedures, Procedures. yes. Procedures. Okay, can, can you give me an example of a procedure in a restaurant? Take Stop. orders. Okay, the way they take orders, good. What else? What else? How do you for say? Uh -huh, yeah, for, exa right. for example, when you arrive to the restaurant, uh, uh, someone great, uh, the customer. Exactly. Usually this person, well, it depends on the restaurant where you go. Usually it's the a waiter or a waitress. Sometimes. So uh, can you mention other examples of procedures? The way that that they took they they cook, for example, the for how to say um, like for llegada arrivals arrivals uh huh like for arrivals the clients that that arrives uh, earlier are um, have 
their dishes um, prepared. Um, prepared faster, I think. Right, right. Good. Yes. Um, the time that you arrive to when you go to a restaurant uh, has a lot to do with how much time you have to wait. Yes. Yeah, so if you arrive early, um, usually you're not going to wait too long. So let me send you this picture. It's in the WhatsApp chat. So it's only two questions. So I want you to think about the way they um, receive you when you go to a restaurant. So let me see this here. So you guys will work with someone different because I had groups of three and four. So let me, room six, move to room six, move to room six, move to room seven, Move to room seven. Move room eight. Move to room eight. Let's see. Move to room nine. Move to room nine. Give me a second. I'm almost finished with everybody. All right, so discuss the two questions. Here we go. Procedures. And I think it's important to have the pro, pro, procedures. 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 Yes, procedures. Rest. ¿Cómo se dice ambiente? Environment. Oh. They are they are making a organized organized environment. Organized. When organized environment because we they have a lot of steps to do for making a 
organizing restaurants. What do you think, Anaraceli? Okay. I think um... a synonym. For example, you, uh, and you make a sentence create with a sample. For... <laughs> try, tr try to make a sentence. This is what 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 do you want to 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 say? For example. Uh, I say que ya son parte del restaurante. <laughs> Maybe maybe the restaurant uh, has different activities. Uh, they have they ha uh, the restaurant has different algo. ¿Cómo que podríamos poner? ¿Qué qué qué podríamos seleccionar? Eh, de pizza, kitchen. Sí, po pong pongamos de que de que si el plato no es de calidad, que eh, que el procedimiento va, va a hacer que el cliente vuelva o no. Ok. Ajá. Y al caso, oh, caso, ajá, y a coger. Por ejemplo, eh, if my, my plate is free, I will return. But eh, if only say sorry i don't i you don't, don't return yes yes right yeah so the, the the restaurant's reaction is very important to the client you know so yes. it, it will decide you know it will be like it will help you decide if you're coming back or not yeah. so it's a, it's a good point. The cost, the customer experience, y that means, eh, tu, tu, como podría ser una, tu experiencia como, como cliente. Yeah. So, maybe. Arthur? Mm -hmm. Ordenador, ordenado. Teacher. Hello. How are Hello. you? Yes. It's a glad to see you, teacher. Same here. Same yes. here. How, how do you say uh, recomendación? Recommendation. Recommendation. Yes. yes. Exactly. And orden, eh, como un orden, pero de, uh -huh, sí, de orden. Uh, like clean, organized, yes. organized. Yes. Uh, yes. I think mm. in the experience, uh, she said my 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 classmate. Who? My classmate. She said that it's important we have an order and in our say in and a one organization. For a good experience. Yep. Uh -huh. Yep. Is that correct? Sure, yeah. Uh, yeah. We can say order. Sure, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Order. Organization. Organization. Um. Mm -hmm. What is that word that people use? Um. Oh my God! I forgot the word. But yeah, order uh -huh. and, and organization is 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 valid. Is good. Mm -hmm. Yep, so those words are, are good to use. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay. Hi. Hello. Uh, hello. Did you finish uh, discussing the questions? Yes. Yes. Okay. So which, which aspects did you discuss? Like uh, the time that you have to wait, the organization of the restaurant, which one did you discuss? We discussed about procedures um, initiate in the parking because if you don't find a space, you leave. You leave. Exactly. Other is the security, other is when you 
in entry and entry. when you go in going in the restaurant and they they give a space or yes, a floor a table a table yes okay you know that that's that's very important what you guys are mentioning like the the, the procedure starts in the parking lot if if the security guard is nice when they when you go in if they receive you in a nice way so different things so it's not mm -hmm. only the food you know the process starts before you enter the uh the restaurant yes mm, uh, marcela says in uh pampa the hi they have ballet parking yes the ballet parking Okay. It's other procedure important. Right, right, right. So uh, when you go uh, to a restaurant and they offer you valet parking, do you use it? No. Uh, yes, in some case, because my mom don't like uh, talk in, in... She doesn't like to walk. De depend if the terreno the land the land yes and the distance yes depend yeah yeah because some parking lots are not in good condition yes others are so the distance between the parking and the restaurant is also a factor yes okay what do you think marcela i saw uh, one time i don't remember uh -huh. but, but parking crashed the car really yes yeah mm -hmm. your car no another oh, car oh, another car yes so, so imagine in that case who, who's responsible in that case does the restaurant respond for or do they have a procedure i don't know well they might yeah they should they should, mm -hmm. but you know, the, the person should have insurance in the card for circumstances like that. So, but yeah. who knows? All right, let me visit another one and then we go back to the main session. Okay. In my house have uh, eight. Uh-huh, yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> Growing, 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 growing. But, but what what is the complete what is the complete uh, sentence, Stephanie? The geckos. Uh huh. They they gecko that they gecko that produce very fast, teacher. Oh yes, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're always busy. <laughs> yeah, so in that case, you say they are growing. They are growing. growing. They are growing. Okay. Yes. Yeah, but the geckos are necessary in in houses, you know, because they control <laughs> insects and other things. Yeah, teacher. Yeah, very important. <laughs> yeah, they they're they're a very important part of all the cycle in your house. En serio? <laughs> yeah. Do you kill them? No. <laughs> you kill them. Oh my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> my dog, my dog los destroza. Really? <laughs> okay. When I was younger, maybe I killed geckos but i was many years ago but now i see geckos and i for me they're they're welcoming my house <laughs> yeah but geckos are 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 necessary teacher they they say they they are poisonous poisonous uh poisonous poisonous yeah okay yeah, because I imagine because they they eat uh, other little animals, so they must be poisonous. Poisonous. Yep. Louis, do you have geckos in your house? Yes, I have. 
Okay. Man, the geckos in my house, uh, uh, they eat cockroach. Yeah, cockroaches. <laughs> cockroaches, mosquitoes. Yeah. And other, uh, uh, so they're healthy. <laughs> <laughs> they're in good condition. <laughs> yeah, ge geckos are, are, are okay. Geckos are good. I don't see eh, lo que antes le llamaban cantil, unos garrobos con oh, cabeza red negra head? y cuerpo. Yeah, an orange head or red head. Red head. Mm -hmm. um, red it's head. true. Red. It's true. I don't see them anymore. Mm. It's true. Uh -huh. I don't know. Maybe they disappeared. Yes, I don't see they. Yeah, they don't, they, they're not common anymore. I am not gonna kill anymore. <laughs> yeah, I remember when I was a kid, I used to play with those little ones, the ones that Louis is mentioning, the ones with the orange head, with the red head. Okay. okay. You cut them and the two parts keep moving, you know? Yeah. Because they're like, even if you separate them, the two parts keep moving. Yes. Yeah. It's good, <laughs> yeah. It was it was part of my childhood. Okay. All right. Talk. <laughs> they they use the protocols of security. Uh, I work in in sales. So we always have a alcohol in hell in the car because I have to travel around uh, the country. So we have a, or, a, our own alcohol and we always use the face mask. And if you have to get down and talk with a client, we put a um, I don't know how do you say careta. Maybe the teacher uh, can face uh, mask. Shield. Or, or face shield. Yes, you can say face, face shield, shield, or mm -hmm. um, yeah, shield is better. A face uh -huh. shield. Face shield is for all head. Exactly. And face mask yeah. is only for your nose and mouth. Right. Yeah. Shield is yeah. better. I we always use facial, and in some case that we have to touch the food, we have to use gloves. Gloves. For, not for, just for security, it's more that the people saw that we protect the, uh, of the food the of problem. the environment. Where do you work, uh, Samuel? Um, Panaria uh, Shadai. Oh, okay. So you're a baker. Yes. No, I'm. I work in sales. Okay. And where is this bakery located? In Mexicanos. Oh. In the... uh, they don't work like like El Rosario with a, a sala de ventas. Okay. They only work uh, like Sinaí that uh, visit. Uh, so you guys do yes. delivery? Yes. All right. Good. How many years have you been there, Samuel? I've been since I have 18. Okay. All right. And I have 20, 24 years old. Okay, you are 24. So you have been there six years? Six years. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, good, good. Nice. Hi. All okay. right. Let's that, uh, All right, um, so are procedures in a restaurant important? 
are pretty important. Why do you say that? Because if we don't follow the procedures, even if we don't work in a restaurant, it's being uh, annoying, not just for me, even for the waitress that don't, don't work like being established. For example, if a client get in a restaurant, it, it, it have to wait for being, uh, how do you say it, uh, colocado? Located. It's been located in, in a table. Uh, the table have a number. So a specific waitress uh, have the, 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 the... It's in charge. It's in charge of that table. So if even for, for one of a customer, uh, if you gave, a, a, for example, Susana is a waitress and you say, I want chicken. And then ask to uh, Juan, Juan, where is my, my chicken? Uh, they will not, what, is, what are you talking about? Because you are not taking the, the, the orders. Right. So, Good. Good, good. Yeah, so procedures in a restaurant are important. Someone else wants to say something about the first question? Uh, well, for me, as far as I can see, uh, procedures in a restaurant are important because it's related with customer experience. The restaurant, uh, uh, they have, uh, should be, uh, for example, a great customer, good food. Uh, uh, they need to see the customers. Uh, in fact, for example, when you when you get the check, for example, uh, you you expect that the waiter uh, give you the check uh, quickly. Right. So, so for me, it's important too. Good. Good. Yes. Uh, if the experience is bad, he does not return to the restaurant. Exactly. It is very important to have produ produ producer, no, uh, procedures yeah. to, to deliver a good service because people are, are happier. Exactly. Service is everything. Yes. Profit, profit go down, teacher. Yes. 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 Yeah. And remember, there is never a second chance to get a, a good first impression. Like Fernando is saying, if you don't have a good experience, you don't return. You simply <laughs> don't come back to the restaurant. So it is very important, yes. Okay, someone else has another opinion? Rocio, we can hear you. I'm sorry. Yes, Rocio. <laughs> How do you say no hay segunda oportunidad para la primera impresión? There is no second chance for the first impression. Thank you. Yes. There is no second chance for the first impression. Okay, someone else? Uh huh. So the second question says, is a customer's experience in a restaurant affected by procedures? How much time do you have to wait when you visit your uh, a restaurant? What is the could, average time? Could be 15 minutes. 15 minutes? 15 minutes is, is, is fast. Too much. Too much. I think 15 no. minutes is 15 or, or 50. No, 15. 15. Yeah, 15, 15. is, is reasonable. Yeah, okay. Yep. Someone else? Something that a restaurant can affect your perception about the place? It always affects because if you wait too long for your food, uh, you will say, no, they are very slower for for serving and if they take too long and the food is cold, we'll say they wait too much, the food is all 
already uh, have ready um, more earlier, so it can be possible that it's called um, even for the attention that they gave you, if they are rude with you as a customer, they you will say, uh, I will not come back here anymore. And exactly. if someone asks someone ask you, hey, are you ever visit um, and whatever name of the restaurant? Oh, yeah, I went once and I will never come back there. Right, right, yes. Okay, do you guys see the chat where I wrote first come, first serve? First come, first serve. What is the meaning of that expression? For example, yeah, in order they llegada. So they they serve you according to the time that you arrived. First come, first serve. Right. But sometimes you have to wait too long. And in like uh Samuel was saying, if you wait too long and then the food is cold, so it, it, it's very possible that you will never return to this place. So first come, first serve is what we call en orden de llegada. Does anybody else have a, another comment for the questions you guys were discussing? No. How do you say pasar lista in English? Attendance. Take attendance. attendance. Yes, take mm -hmm. attendance. So when you hear your name, I want you to say here. Sophia Stephanie. Here, present. Okay. Uh, Fernando Arturo. Present, teacher. Very good. Uh, Coralia. Present, teacher. Good. Uh, Ronald Humberto. Present. Okay. Katia Marcela. Present. Okay. Uh, Jimmy Rodriguez. Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. Jimmy Sampson. Okay. Uh, Christian Alexander. Present. Good. Uh, Josué Edgardo. Present. Good. Jimena Alexandra. Present. Good. We have Samuel Rosales. He's right here. Uh, Rocio Mejia. Present. Very good. Uh, Mercy Carolina. Present. Okay, very good. Uh, Ana Araceli. Present teacher. Very good, Anaraceli. Maria del Carmen. Present teacher. Very good. Uh, Helen Mercedes. Here. Good. Luis Escobar. Present teacher. Very good. Uh, Stephanie Montano. Here teacher. Okay, very good. Uh, Christian Omar, he's absent. Okay, Wendy Guadalupe, present teacher. Very good. And the last one is Magdalena Emperatriz, present teacher. Very good. All right, so we have two people that are absent Jimmy and Christian. All right, good. Um, any questions about the first uh, exercise on page 17? No? Okay, so let me show you the second part. 